Average pace 435. I'm just struggling real, real bad. Real bad. Oh, sorry. these wristbands that you have to keep on until, until the, tomorrow until you finish until the you finish the race I've got a shower with this on we're at the expo now so this is where you have to come to pick up your bibs the day before get your wristband and what else do we do check do all the COVID yeah. passport checks and all that malarkey <laughs> got to pop the mask back on and um, we're heading in now oh my god I'm so excited it's an old airfield, isn't it? Yeah. For the marathon tomorrow. We won't be near these though. <laughs> <laughs> This is the main expo, isn't it? Yeah. Where there's loads of like running stores That's a big and, fair. and we're going to get our race bibs now. Well, there seems to be a lot of shops, so you have to control yourself a bit. Yeah. Okay. Looked into too much. They are very most in the high Where should we go? Should we get our bibs first? Yeah. I am sure, yeah. Oh, a Morton stand here. Look. Most people will probably just buy the gels here. Okay. I'm sure the risk is trying to go in. Okay. <laughs> Only wrist banded people allowed in. Where do we go? Oh, can I just write it down? Or? You've got to the finish line and there you get a medal and some water to drink and after then you get the that's oh, it. That's a seven, right? Yes, that's yeah. a seven. Mm -hmm. Nine thirty five. That's the start then. Mm -hmm. Starting number, starting area is F. The tip for timekeeping, you have to wear it on a shoe. Oh, okay. It picks up all the laces. That way. Okay. And then you give it back after the race in one of these boxes. Okay. 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 And you get a poncho after the finish line, so you don't get a back from on the side. Okay. Okay, thank you. Oh, this expo is dangerous. There's just too much stuff to buy. I saw these online and uh, so I was looking at them online the other day. So, see them here, tried them on, pretty nice. 
bar shop, you spend already. It's like hookah heaven here. Got all the models, all the, the colour, all the colourways. Just running now. Uh, always go for a little run pre-race day, just to sort of flush out the legs um, from travel and just being really stiff. So. What is it, 5k we normally do? Is it something like that? Yeah. 5k. Oh, it's very warm actually. Oh, 21 degrees at the moment. Tomorrow is meant to be 25 degrees. With some sun. So it's going to be a tough one. This morning, at breakfast, we're into the event now, it's about 2k away. Oh yeah, that's on now. The sun's out, it's supposed to be around, what, 25 today, degrees Celsius. Atmosphere's building slowly, roads are all closed. Which way should we go? Nervous? Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> nervous. Yeah, heart rates are high again. Nice day, isn't it? I actually had a decent night's sleep last night for the first time all week. I am ill, but I think I'm coming to the end of that illness. Last night I had such a long sleep. Uh, I won't go into too much details, but yeah, I'm on various amounts of medicines. Antibiotics and stuff, but I actually feel not too bad this morning. Whether that's just adrenaline or medicine or coming to the end of the sickness, but we'll find out how it goes in the run. So, I can hear just behind me now the elites have just started. Oh, Big Kelly going for the world record. It's going to be tough in this heat, but good luck yeah. to him. Um, I start in what? I'm in the second wave, which will be 9.35. I should know this, shouldn't I? I think 9.35. Yeah, I'm in the second wave, so just need to get one more toilet break. Do some drills, warm up, and uh, just done my run now. A little 2K warm up run. I'll do some activation drills, some stretching. If you have time. If I have time. Uh, yeah, come on then, let's find where we're going. Start the cross line, you can take it off. Well, we're still next to each other, aren't we? And we're breathing heavy and spitting. 
so I don't get that. But anyway. Enjoy the run? Yeah. I'll try to. Ciao ciao. <laughs> So, I've been training for 3.15, but because the week I've had, <laughs> I might abandon that, but we'll see, I'll, I'll know more during the run. If my lungs just give up, I'm, I'm not going to go crazy, but see how it goes. <laughs> not the whole <laughs> the way, oh, just a li little bit. <laughs> For YouTube. <laughs> uh, perfect. Thanks to your gang and your family. Thank you. Bye bye. Yeah, but you got subscribed, mate. I think that's what channels. <laughs> nice wide roads and flat as well. But it's hot. I feel it already. You can definitely feel that heat on the skin. <coughs> Just taking a strep, so throat's a bit scratchy. Oh, this is hectic. Chaos. Absolute chaos at drink stations. Well, there you go, the first drink station. Just gone past, well, a little bit further than 5k. Average pace, oh, 5k, 5.3k, 450 average pace. And I've just done a drink station, got some water on my face. But my God, that was chaotic. Crashing into people. Didn't even risk their uh, filming there. Too many people. People just throwing drinks back on the floor. Yeah, not great. I'm just hoping this clears out. Because I'm trapped at the moment with like the four, four minute 50 to five minute um, kilometre pace for this. There's nothing I can do about that. It's so difficult to overtake people. So, yeah, I'm hoping it clears. And once it's cleared, I'm gonna start making move. <laughs> Got some beeps on there. <laughs> it's so hot now. Pace we are. Average pace, 451. 6.64 kilometers in. And it's warm, I tell you that. The sun's beaming down now. It's starting to open up very slightly. So, I'm hoping another few K, it opens up. It's completely my fault, I came to the wave late. I should have been at the start of this wave too, but I wasn't. So it's no one's fault but mine. Going over a nice bridge now. Let's see what we can see. shade here nice and cool just hit the 8k mark 8.12 uh, average pace 450 still stuck really it's getting a bit more cramped as we going through quite a busy city area but I'm trying I'm trying to take spots and weave in and out but it's difficult and we're taking a few people now. When it get opens up, I take the chance. Thank you. Oh, chaos, chaos, chaos. Gotta get out of the way. Come on, bro. Oh, I can't even drink this. Ah, uh, oh, oh, that was good. I can't drink it. Just splash on my face. Absolute chaos at these drink stations. Do not like that. Lose so much space. Just smashing in at people. People just throw it on the floor when they've been done so. I need to separate. 
I need to separate from this big pack. I'm ready to go now. So I've just hit 10k mark. Pace, average pace 447. Still stuck in this group. Uh, I'm overtaking quite a few people when I get a chance. Right now. But then you get stuck again. And just have to wait. But yeah, those drink stations are insane. I hope it's not like that all the way through. Let's overtake some more people. Yes, got a bit of space here. Take advantage of it. It's so different to training. There's just a million things on your mind. Let me get in this shade actually. That's better. Things like that, if you get a chance to get in shade, take it. Catch you in a bit. Let's join this chaos. Oh. Difficult to drink when it's in cup, but at least you can splash it on your face, isn't it? Oh, Jesus, I can't even drink. Oh. Next, 12k in, average pace 444. Getting little pockets of space now to maneuver so I can feel like the pack is thinning out each K we go in. The atmosphere is amazing though, absolutely amazing. You can tell this is just a different level of event that I've ever run. Just hit 15k mark. Oh, drink station, average pace. 4.43, 5k, 15k in. Let me get another drink. Oh god, it's so difficult to drink from cup. Yeah, 15.2k in every pace 442. So I'm not a million miles away from marathon pace. But yeah, see how long it lasts. <laughs> DMX, rest in peace. Love a bit of DMX. 16.1k, average pace 443. One oh, more shade. It's really warm. I'm just going to get water at the next station and just put it on my head. Okay, halfway through, 21k, average pace 442. A little bit of drama at the water station back there. Yeah, as I was getting some water, drank it, I came out of the station. Somebody ran into the back of me. I stumbled. He definitely fell over. Uh, so if you're watching this on YouTube later and you're the guy that fell over, sorry about that. But you need to like not clatter into people at water stations. I know it's difficult, but if you're behind someone, expect them to slow down dart left dart right and that's exactly why i'm worried about it but i hope you're okay buddy the half the road's really sunny if i was them i'd come on this side take it by every advantage you can get if you can run more in the shade of course it's going to be an advantage they should move over to this side if i was them it's up to them I'm getting to the point now where everything's going to come down to how well you've trained, pacing, fuel, mid 25. What are we on? Like, yeah, mid, mid, mid 20s. As it starts to get to the late 20s, it's like crunch time. Then as you enter like 28 to 32k mark that's when the marathon really starts 
I'm feeling no way near as I did in Leeds a couple, three weeks ago. Two weeks ago, was it? Three weeks ago, something like that. At the halfway mark. I was so fresh in Leeds when I finished that half, running at marathon pace, but today, no. Definitely not feeling like I was in Leeds. 100%. What was he on? 20. 4.7k average pace 441 28.8k average pace 440 oh i forgot how brutal the marathon is i'm telling you i can't sit here stand here run here and tell you how i know how to feel for marathon because i don't I'm a novice at this distance, to be honest, I forgot, I'm still in half marathon mindset and the marathon is just a different animal, I know that, oh god, 30, 30.5k in, average pace 439, I'm drowning, Oh god, it's not good. Thirty-two K mark. I don't know if you can hear me, it's pretty loud. Thirty-two K mark. Average pace four three eight. And I'm drowning. Oh god. Drowning guys. I just gotta run another 10k. I gotta run another 10k. And then I'm done. I gotta do it. I've gotta do this. I'm so close, I can't give up now. Hold me on. Oh god. Oh god. 35k into this race. 35k in average pace 437. I gotta turn it on now. I'll see you near the finish line. I'll see you near the finish line. Oh 40k, 40k in. Average pace 435. I'm just struggling real, real bad. Real bad. Oh, sorry. 42k. Nearly finished. Finish line. 42k. 4 minutes 35. Average pace. I'm broken. I'm so broken. Oh, please finish. Please. Please finish. Come on! Please! Please finish! Oh, come on, please! I'm so broken! Come on, please! Finish! Oh, oh, oh. I'm broken. Aus der Schweiz. I'm absolutely broken. Martin Hess. Okay, I don't think I got one, three, fifteen. I can't see me getting it because my Garmin was way off. Oh, glad I'm broken. Well, that's the hardest thing I've ever done. I'm telling you now. I'm finished. I need a break from this. I really need a break from all this. My throat's on fire. Alexander. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. I need some water quick. Oh uh, man. <coughs> Marathon is just insane. Caesar from Venezuela. 
Gideon, Christian, Oliver, so, so Fabiola, Vit. Jetzt gab es dann. Um, I don't know if I got 350, but you know what? I don't care. Läufer ist ins Ziel gekommen, hat den Marathon augenscheinlich gewonnen. Really don't aber was ist passiert? Man hat nachgemessen. Probably will later on, but I just. I'm so proud. I don't want to blow my own trumpet, but. <laughs> I said I didn't want to talk about it too much. I don't want to bore you to death with all the illness, but yeah, it's been a real rough week. And yeah, I'm just so proud I finished this with a decent time. Oh, I see, thank you. Let's go to this bike. Medal. I'm just gonna show you, I can't even talk. <coughs> I feel like I need a rest from all this. Like mentally, I'm just done. But it was good, the support was unbelievable, the route was unbelievable. <coughs> I've got no internet connection, I don't know why that is. Uh, so I can't find Sai. So I'm gonna head back to the hotel. I feel like I've just been through the, the mills. I think I'm gonna be so sore tomorrow. I'd be surprised if I'm not. I just feel like I've been through hell. <laughs> it felt like hell. It was hot at times, really hot. Um, I'm so glad the water was in cups actually. It was so difficult to drink, but yeah, just being able to splash it on your face and on your head. Something you gotta practice with those cups because every time I was trying to drink, you just couldn't get any good, like gulps of water. You were just wasting it all in your face. But, yeah, it was tough. Back to the hotel now. I hope so I can realise what's happened and come back. <laughs> Post-marathon walk. 